Hey guys, I'm just taking a quick break and having a pipe. On my way home. Um, but I just wanted to show you what I'm smoking. Um, earlier this, this year, during the summer, I was on a holiday in uh, up in Seattle and I went to a tobacconist um, that you might be familiar with if you know Northwest um, pipe smoker Tom uh, he goes to a, a, a his local tobacconist uh, I think it's called Cargo Hold And the interesting thing to me about uh, that tobacconist is um, I grew up for many years up in that area. And so when I was a kid, um, when I was small, probably 10, 11, 12, um, I remember going into this, um, this shop, although at that time um, it was not a tobacconist shop. Um, it sold... Uh, um, kind of like nautical themed uh, trinkets and whatnot. The same as it does now, but it, now it has in the back um, uh, a small tobacconist area. And so I was there this summer and dropped by and talked to Doug. He's the owner of the shop. And a uh, really nice guy. If you're ever in the area, um, you should drop in and check it out. Anyway, I wanted to uh, grab some tobacco uh, while I was there, so um, and talk to Doug, and and uh, he suggested a, a couple of things to me. Um, but I picked up this. It's um, it was in his in his bulk. Uh, supply. It's Black Sea Balkan. And um, the interesting thing um, he said about this is it's it's um, it's actually a, a copy of uh, Kamoy's cask number 11. So, if you look up Kamoy's cast number 11, you'll see that it's made of Virginias and primarily uh, Oriental base with some Latakia. Um, and the Latakias on this blend is more in the background. And I would agree with that. The Latakia just is more of a supporting structure and the Orientals are kind of what give it its flavor. But as far as um, but as far as Orientals go, it's a very subtle, very soft Oriental Balkan uh, mixture. It's not very harsh. It's really one of those uh, blends that that you can smoke all day. It's very easy. It's not harsh. It doesn't bite you at all. And, well, let me show you the tobacco. Let's see if you can see it here. So, the cut, there's nothing special on the cut. It's a kind of a ribbon, uh, kind of a crumbled ribbon cut, fine ribbon, uh, broken apart. Um, but the blend is uh, surprisingly a really good blend uh, to me. One of those just a straight, I would say mild to medium Balkan, uh, a blend that you can easily smoke um, all day. Uh, 
if you're if you're able to smoke while you're working or you know working in the yard or whatever you're doing whatever kind of task you're doing it's one of those that just provides you with a really good smoke but doesn't get in the way mm. smoking it in uh, one of my Mersham pipes I like it it gives me a really good sense the flavors uh, of the tobaccos and uh, it always has a gives me a really good smoke so that's it guys just a short one just wanted to sh show you the the tobacco that I'm smoking and um, uh, I'm gonna get going and, and uh, head out head to my house and um, we'll see you guys later. Hope you guys have uh, a good day, a good pipe. We'll see you again.